the Fédération Internationale des Associations de Footballeurs Professionnels English, International Federation of Professional Footballers, generally referred to as FIFPRO, is the worldwide representative organization for 65,000 professional footballers. FIFPRO, with its global headquarters in Hoofdorp, Netherlands, is made up of 63 national players associations. In addition, there are five candidate members and eight observers. History On 15 December 1965, representatives of the French, Scottish, English, Italian and Dutch Players Associations met in Paris, with the objective of setting up an international federation for footballers. In the second half of June 1966, the first Fife Pro Congress took place in London, just before the start of the World Championship. The Articles of Association of Fife Pro were thereby adopted and the objectives accurately laid down. Fife Pro was responsible for increasing the solidarity between professional footballers and players' associations. Fife Pro tried to offer the players' associations or other interest associations the means for mutual consultation and cooperation to achieve their objectives. In addition, it wished to coordinate the activities of the different affiliated groups in order to promote the interests of all professional footballers. Indeed, Fife Pro likewise had in mind propagating and defending the rights of professional footballers. The emphasis was thereby laid on the freedom of the football player to be able to choose the club of his choice at the end of his contract. It was likewise laid down that Fife Pro would be helpful in every required area for setting up interest associations. These are objectives which still apply to this day. It was originally laid down that a Congress would be held once every four years at a minimum, prior to the World Championship. The Congress had to uphold the course set out and with a two-third majority vote. The Congress is still the most important organ of Fife Pro to this very day. It soon appeared that it was necessary to organize a Congress annually, and not to limit this to once every four years. Many Congresses have been held in the meantime, such as for example in 1978 in Madrid and in 1979 in Athens and Venice. In the 80s and 90s many memorable congresses have been organized in almost all the large European cities, such as Paris, Athens, Milan, Manchester, Zurich, Ghent, Lisbon, Edinburgh, Copenhagen, Tel Aviv, Rome, Johannesburg, Barcelona, Santiago and Budapest. The latest congress was in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, in November 2010. The objectives of Fife Pro also mean that not only FIFA applied as a talking partner. UEFA in particular, but also the European Parliament and the European Commission appeared to be important points of approach. The national federations also started to become increasingly aware that, in addition to the National Players Association, the international trade union Fife Pro also played its role. In recent years, Fife Pro has grown from a European organization into a global network. The Fife Pro has done much to support countries on other continents, Asia, Oceania, Africa and South America, in their efforts to set up players' associations. In October 2012, Fife Pro welcomed the Footballers' Associations of Croatia, Czech Republic, Montenegro and Ukraine as its newest members. In 2013, Fife Pro launched a legal challenge against the transfer system. Fife Pro President Philippe Piat said, "...the transfer system fails 99% of players around the world, it fails football as an industry and it fails the world's most beloved game." According to Fife Pro's European president Bobby Barnes, 28% of the money from a transfer fee is paid to agents, and that many players are not paid on time or at all. He claims this leads to these players being "...vulnerable targets of crime syndicates, who instigate match fixing and threaten the very existence of credible football competitions." 
Writing for the BBC, Matt Slater said, "...professional footballers do not enjoy the same freedoms that almost every other EU worker does," and that, "...players look at US sport, and wonder why their career prospects are still constrained by transfer fees and compensation costs." Barnes argues that, the system encourages speculative, unsustainable, immoral and illegal investment models like third-party ownership of players. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Current board. The Fife Pro board consists of 11 members, including President Philippe Piat for the term 2013 to 2017. He has been president since the Fife Pro Congress in Ljubljana in October 2013. The board members are President Philippe Piat, UNFP, France; Vice President 2019 Francis Arwarite, Australia; Board members Bobby Barnes, PFA, England; Louis Everard, VVCS, Netherlands; Leonardo Grosso, AIC, Italy; Mads Oland, Spilleforeningen, Denmark; Fernando Revilla, SAFAP, Peru; Luis Rubiales, AFE, Spain; Dejan Stefanovic, Spins, Slovenia. General Secretary Theo van Segelen, Netherlands. In 1998, for the first time in Fife Pro history, a board member was elected by the General Assembly. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Members. Founded on 15 December 1965, Fife Pro has 63 full members, one special member, three candidate members and six observers. Upon graduation to the next level, new members sign an affiliation agreement that promotes loyalty, integrity and fairness as well as principles of good governance, including open and transparent communications, democratic processes, checks and balances, solidarity and corporate social responsibility. Full members Topic: Special Members. Palestine. Topic: Candidate Members. Topic: Observers. Topic: Awards. Each year since 2005, Fife Pro invited all professional men's footballers in the world to compose the best men's team of the year, named the Fife Pro World Eleven. Every player was requested to pick one goalkeeper, four defenders, three midfielders and three forwards. In 2009, the World Players' Union joined hands with FIFA. While the format remained the same, the award name changed to the FIFA Fife Pro World Eleven. This became the only team award picked by all professional footballers worldwide. Each year in September, approximately 45,000 voting ballots are sent out to professional footballers associations that are Fife Pro members or candidate members, who are then asked to distribute the forms among all professional footballers in their countries. In October these are returned to Fife Pro's head office. At the end of November, Fife Pro and FIFA together announce the 55-player shortlist, consisting of five goalkeepers, 20 defenders, 15 midfielders and 15 forwards. In January the votes are counted, and the 11-man FIFA Fife Pro World XI is revealed at the FIFA Ballon d'Or ceremony in Zurich, Switzerland. From 2005 until 2008, Fife Pro also asked the footballers to choose the Fife Pro Player of the Year. 
From 2009 on, the election for FIFA Pro Player of the Year merged with the FIFA World Player of the Year, and in 2010 combined with France Football's Ballon d'Or into one award, the FIFA Ballon d'Or. In 2014, FIFA Pro launched a women's football committee. In February 2016, FIFA Pro Women's World XI was launched. Players of 33 different nationalities in over 20 countries participated in voting for one goalkeeper, four defenders, three midfielders and three forwards. FIFA Five Pro World XI Winners <inaudible> 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 Players marked bold won the FIFA World Player of the Year 2005 to 2009, the FIFA Ballon d'Or 2010 to 2015, or the Best FIFA Men's Player 2016 present in that respective year. Topic: <laughs> Appearances by player. Topic: <laughs> Appearances by club Players in italics have made appearances with multiple clubs, and appearances are separated accordingly. <laughs> appearances by nationality <laughs> Continental appearances Topic Five Pro Women's World Eleven Topic Winners Players marked bold won the FIFA World Player of the Year 2001 to 2015 or the Best FIFA Women's Player 2016 present in that respective year. Topic Appearances by player Topic Appearances by club Topic Appearances by nationality Topic Five Pro World Player of the Year, two thousand and five to two thousand and eight. Five Pro granted this award between two thousand and five to two thousand and eight. In two thousand and nine, it merged with FIFA World Player of the Year, which was succeeded by the FIFA Ballon d'Or in twenty ten. Topic. Five Pro Young Player of the Year, two thousand and five to two thousand and eight. Five Pro granted this award between two thousand and five to two thousand and eight, after which it was discontinued. Topic See also FIFA Ballon d'Or Ballon d'Or FIFA World Player of the Year The Best FIFA Football Awards <laughs>